Adel here, and you're probably here because you want to know how to make this tree collage that I just did. So let's get on to it, shall we? First up, the materials. You're gonna need a notebook or a piece of paper to put the collage on, another piece of paper or two, and markers and a pen. First, you're gonna need your set of markers and take out number 47 and 46. We're going to be drawing the grass now. So, we're going to use number 47 for the base color. Draw a rectangular box and color it in. Or you can just do what I did. Just color the rectangular box. No need for an outline. Now you're going to be using number 46 to do the details. All you have to do for the details are draw some spikes. Some short, some long, some big, some small. So now we're going to be drawing the dandelion. If you want to draw more than one dandelion, it's totally fine. That's your collage, not mine. For the colors, you're going to choose WG6 Warm Gray, 47 Grass Green, and 35 Lemon Yellow. With these three colors, you're going to make the dandelion. First, choose Grass Green to make the stem. Draw a curved line, not too long, but not too short either. Now you're going to use lemon yellow to draw the bud. Just a circle. Now you're going to use WG6 to make the dandelion seeds. Draw some lines sticking out and then draw fuzzier lines. To draw the fuzzy lines, it's kind of like the grass ones, just shorter. Make them connect. Now we're going to draw the bush. We're only going to be using one marker, which is number 43, deep olive green. Draw the letter B but sideways and color it like the video shown you're also free to put this little bump in between the bees and color it and that's your bush now grab your pen and we're going to be drawing the tree to draw the tree stump draw a line and at the bottom widen it don't close any of the edges because we're not going to be doing any of that use your pen and color it in but not fully color it in Leave some white spots. Now we're going to draw the tree leaves. Choose your selection of green markers. I chose number 44, number 57, number 59, number 49, number 41, and number 46. One by one, use the markers to make splotches as the tree leaves. In some areas, just draw little dots and lines. Now use your pen and draw a tree branch on the side that has the most leaves. Now that we're done drawing the tree, choose number 91 and color the trunk. So I never really intended to draw the butterfly, the birds and the bee. So. The footage I'm showing you isn't the actual bee, butterfly, and birds that are shown in the picture. They're just a tutorial on how to draw them. Alright? Now, the way to draw those birds are really simple, and I'm sure most of you guys have done it before. But in case you don't, here's how. All you need is your pen, and then you're going to draw a really wide V. But the V's lines are a bit curved. After you draw the V, you're going to make other mini V's. V's just like that, just smaller around it. Here are some examples how you can do it. The way to draw the butterfly is more advanced than the birds, but still easy nonetheless. Choose your color of choice. To draw the wings, you're going to draw an oval-like shape, or something sort of heart-like. Uh, petals mm, or clovers. After you're done drawing, 
Just color the insides. After coloring, get out your pens because we're going to be drawing the butterfly's body. To draw the butterfly's body, draw a really long oval and coming at the top of it are their antennas. To draw the antennas, draw this curved line that's coming into a spiral. So this is optional. If you want, you can draw shapes or patterns on the butterfly's wings. The last and final step for drawing the butterfly is draw the outline of the wings. Last but not least, we're going to be drawing the bee, which is the hardest among the three. The color for the bee is number 33. The footage got deleted, so I'm just going to show you this picture, all right? Okay, so you're going to be drawing an oval-like shape, like a lemon that's on its side, and then you're going to color it in. So the wings color is going to be number 68, turquoise blue. On top of your oval, you're going to be drawing the wings, which are longer ovals. So it will look like this, and then you're going to color it in. Now you're going to go outline the bee. Outline its wings, outline its body, yeah, you get it. To draw the face of the bee, just draw two dots and voila! Now draw curved lines inside the body. Color some in and those are its stripes. At the back of the bee, draw a triangle and color the triangle in and that will be its stinger. At the back, draw some lines, really short ones, and draw a loop-de-loop -loop with those short lines. Now you can go cut the pictures and paste it in your paper or notebook. First, paste the grass and then paste the birds then the tree, then either the butterfly or the bee, then the bush, and then the dandelion. If you have more than one dandelion, then just paste the other dandelions to your liking. And boom, there you have it, your own tree collage. Thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe, that would mean a lot to me. And bye-bye, see you in the next video.